hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's full stun guide called natural selection which wants you to own and drive the 2004 mitsubishi lance evolution to complete all of the challenges with so without further ado let's get stuck in now this is the 2004 mitsubishi lancer evo not to be confused with the 2006 model which looks very similar uh, in essence, this one is 31,000 credits, only 2006 is about 27,000 credits. But either way, if you leave it uh, on the icon, it will scroll across and show you the year of whichever Evo you're looking at. Now, the share code for the tune I've created is 840719780. It's called Forzathon, and hopefully it should help you guys out. Moving on to the first challenge here, it simply wants you to earn a hard charger skill. Now, for those of you who don't know, a hard charger skill is a burnout skill, quickly followed by a speed skill. So I'd recommend somewhere with a nice long road to do this, such as the main highway. Now, obviously, a burnout skill could be quite difficult in a four-wheel drive car when compared to a front-wheel drive or rear-wheel drive. However, if you hold down the handbrake and just accelerate straight off, you're pretty much going to get a burnout skill. Now, if you're struggling with it that way, I'll show you another way in a second. But once you've got that burnout skill, you want to just keep on driving flat out until you see a speed skill pop up. And then following that, as you can see there, you'll get the hard charger. So there is probably about five to ten seconds between getting each skill. Now, the other way to do a burnout skill with a four-wheel drive car is to reverse and then quickly change into first and just bomb it down the motorway and then get your speed skill. You're pretty much going to be guaranteed a burnout skill doing it that way and then the speed and the hard charger skill. Moving on to the next challenge here, it wants you to earn two stars at the Mountain Pass Speed Zone. Now, this doesn't say whether you can get two stars in one run or two runs of just one star, but either way, I'm going to show you how to get two stars on one run going in both directions. Now this is a mountain pass speed zone, two stars on here is only 105 mile an hour which is fairly easy. So to start with we're going to start from the east side of the speed trap here and I'm going to show you how to get two stars here and then afterwards I'll show you on the return journey how to get two stars that way. Now like I said I'm using my Forzathon A class tune for this. The reason it's A class is for the last challenge which we will of course come on to in a second. Now when coming from this direction you want to watch out for this first bend here because if you mess that up you will end up uh, going up that sort of rocky wall and that will ruin that run. But as long as you enter it at sort of over 120 mile an hour the speed zone from that direction you should be fine just remember to take the corners quite nicely uh, not fly through them and cut them because you'll still quite easily get two stars as you saw there now the return leg we're literally going to start from straight ahead as you saw there and come back i've sped the footage up because i don't want to bore you guys too much but again it's fairly similar although you can cut that last corner which makes it a little bit easier uh, and in this run we got 119 mile an hour but either way both runs well over the two star mark now moving on to the final challenge here, it wants you to win either a road or a dirt race in A class. So to do this I picked of course a road race, that is the Arch of Mulehay circuit. This is one lap with no AI driver tires, the share code is on your screen there. Um, and this again is really easy to complete. Now you don't need to be in an A class specific race as long as your car is A class, that will count for the challenge. Uh, and once you win this race that will be the last challenge complete there. So hopefully this guide has helped you out, but of course if you are struggling with this or any other challenge then please do let me know down below in the comments, I'm more than happy to help you guys out. Whether it's to do with a hard charger skill or something completely different, just let me know down below. But anyway folks, like I said I hope this helped you out, if it did and you're new to the channel I'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe and dropping a like massively helps me out as well. But apart from that folks I want to thank you very much for watching, make sure you stay safe and take care.